guys, Easter is not biblical. Go Sarset. <laughs> hello. Uh, hello, my friend. Uh, we talked uh, one time. I don't know if you remember me. No, I don't. Remind me yourself if you, if you don't mind. Um, we talked and I, I want to apologize because... Uh, I looked up all the things you said uh, about Islam and uh, you were very, very right. So, uh, first of all, I just want to apologize from you. No problem. Yes. So, can you remind me what the conversation last time between me and you was? Um, the conversation was about the miracle of the Quran where I said where the water mixed to you. Uh -huh. Remember? I don't really remember. Sorry. You know, I, you know, as you know, I, I speak to thousands of people, so it's very hard to remember I talk to whom. Yes. Uh, okay, so so what was your claim when you t spoke to me last time? Uh, my claim was uh, that there there are uh, many miracles and uh, the water where it's mentioned that uh, doesn't mix. Hmm. You said uh, that uh, it is like a cycle, which is, uh, of, of course, true. Hmm. And there were some other things. I always uh, watch your stream and uh, I thought uh, Islam is like a little bit like... My English is not so good. It's not like no worry. My uh, English is not, buried, my buried, English buried is not so good too. You know, when I go to the grocery store here in America, I spend half hour to explain what I want to buy. Trust me, but this is not a problem. So now, <laughs> uh, because I go and look looking for shampoo, and they don't know what shampoo. You know, it turned to be that it's shampoo, not shampoo. But anyway, so <laughs> uh, yeah. so my friend, um, uh, after you learn all those things, Muslim, they, they, they say, and you are a Muslim. Did I'm not. Uh, I'm not actually anymore. I I, I would not call myself a Muslim, but uh, I want to say something. Uh, it, with Islam being uh, false, doesn't mean uh, that uh, Christianity true. Okay. So I I just have some doubt about Christianity, and so I wanted to call you because because I think you're like um, how can I say like master of religion, you know. No, I'm I'm nobody. I'm you know I'm nothing really. I you know I'm just a but, person uh, like you. We have to be honest. You have a very huge uh, knowledge. Okay. So uh, I saw to, when I asked somebody, I have really to ask Christian Prince. So okay, before we uh, go, I'm very happy be, that uh, before that you we are go, can, can I use your name? name? Can I use your name? that one appear in Skype to call you or no? Uh, my name, like my Skype name. Yeah. Yes, of course you can okay. use. So your name is Ammar, correct? Yes. All right. Ammar. Yes. So I'm more. So but, I spoke to but, you about uh, Islam and I'm, you decided. Uh, but I'm not. Uh, but, but I'm not Arabic, by the way. No problem. No problem. Yeah. No problem. No so I mean, you Don't mix it up because I know you speak Arabic, so yeah. don't be confused no, no, no. when, no, when it's, you it's say okay. Arabic it's and okay. I don't understand. So because I spoke to you and I showed you the reference and the proof, you decided to leave Islam, correct? Yes. All right. And now you are wondering if Christianity is good for you, correct? If if it's correct, I read some things. I I'm very honest. I took, uh, I took my time and uh, looked Old Testament, and New Testament, uh, and as far as I see, it's a very peaceful religion, which is uh, like fitting to my side of life. You know what I? Yeah, uh, but you I know, mean. it's not a reason to join any belief because it's peaceful. Because it, some people yes. they can be peaceful, but they yes. can be cult too. You know, so peaceful is not yes. a reason. So now, what is making you hesitate to accept Christianity as uh, faith for you? I I really have. It's just one. It's just one. Uh, one uh, is it called verse in okay. English uh, in Christianity, which makes me like doubt. It's about Trinity, you All know. Right. It's about Trinity. It's uh, should I say? Okay, go where, ahead. Uh, in uh, Marcus thirteen uh, thirty two. Mm -hmm. uh, I think uh, Jesus is asked, when does the day of judgment come? And he said, nor do I know, nor do the angel in the heaven know. Mm -hmm. Je it only knows God. So it's like, how can, if Jesus is God, how can he not know? Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, my friend, first of all, you need to understand that in Christianity, when we say we believe in a trinity, that's mean there's a tree, not yes. just one individual, correct? Yes. Okay. Do Jesus call in the same chapter, he called the Father, Father? Yes. All right. When I say, if you come to me and you ask me, uh, can I borrow the car? I say, we'll ask my father. 
Yes. Does that mean I don't own the car? Or um, still there is somebody, he is the one who is, is in charge. Okay. So what Jesus is saying, that the judgment day, the announcement of judgment day is in the hand of the Father. But in the same okay. time, in the same time, okay. the one who is in charge of the judgment day is the Messiah. Because if you read okay. the same in the same chapter, you know, mm -hmm. the same chapter, you will see that Jesus is speaking that how he will come when all the 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 the, the reasoning for the judgment day happen. And in Christianity, we don't believe in the preset date for judgment day. We don't believe in preset destiny. That's why if we go in the Old Testament, when uh, when they ask God if there is, uh, what about if there is 70 decent people in the city, you will destroy it? He said, no. What about if there is 10, maybe five, you know? He, say, he said, no, you will not destroy it. Yes. If there is still yes. decent people. So God is, is fair and justice. So we, the, the people, as fast as we corrupt the day, the life we live in, as fast judgment day come on us. This is why the announcement is going to be an announcement is not going to be a decision. What does that mean? Uh, but but uh, it's like, can I interrupt it's like, you for a second? Uh -huh. uh, it's not about announcement. It's uh, like, as far as I understand, he said when, like he asked when it is. It's like a matter of uh, knowledge, not a matter of announcing. You know what I say? Yeah, we, we see. Well, and uh, even the word there is translation. It says no, right? So still that will not change anything. Because Jesus, he told you that he knows everything about the judgment day. If you read the same chapter, you will see that Jesus saying, this will happen, and this will happen, and this will happen, and this will happen. And when all those things happen, me, I'm coming. The coming of the... Uh, yeah. okay. So Jesus, he, he knew the future. If, so if you are wondering about knowing the future, well, the same chapter is showing you how much future Jesus, he knew. So how come he did not know that day? When he knew that when he knew that day, the judgment day will happen, as you see in the front of you. If you go right now, if we open Mark, uh, if you read from the beginning, you will find that Jesus is telling you in details, the step by step, the step until the judgment day. So if a, if a person is saying, well, how come Jesus is God, but you do not know the day? Well, obviously he knew the day. But isn't he not but lying? Let me finish. He, 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 knew, he knew the day, the last day, which is before the day of the resurrection. Because he tell you when those things happen, then the judgment day will come. So how, but, how it, he say... I don't, want to, I don't want to hurt your feeling, but isn't he lying when he says, I don't know? No, he's not. Because I Although just, he knows? No, it's not about... You see, this is not about uh, his lying, my friend. Uh, First of all, there is wisdom, not for the father not to tell anyone. Why? Because simply, if I tell, if I tell you tomorrow is going to be judgment day, suddenly you become a believer, and you pray, and you repent, yes. and you are saved. Correct? Yes. But, yes. But the Lord, he says, that he will come the same as a thief in the middle of the night, where, where nobody expects him. So there's no expectation, this is condition. Nobody is thinking it's going to happen. This is this is a condition. And when those conditions happen, when all those corruption happen, as Jesus speaks in the same chapter, then the judgment day will happen because that will be an announcement more than a decision. I, I told you that God will not destroy this earth if there is still uh, uh, righteous people. Did I say that already? Yes, you said okay. that. So, so uh, uh, and we are um, nations around the earth. We do not know if there's one nation in China. One person in China left his uh, righteous or not, or maybe one in USA, or maybe in your country. I don't know where your country is. So we, we, human, being, human being, you don't have human being. You don't have full knowledge about everybody around the world. How many righteous people there are still there? So when yes. we are out of righteous people, that day, the day the Lord will announce. The judgment day. Okay. So the decision, the decision, is is more than a decision. It is an announcement because it is in our hand. Yes, He is our Lord. He is our God. But it is us who fasten the corruption, and then the judgment day come fast, or it's us who slow it down. So, but, uh, and, and, and here what, you might say to yourself, the, what, what about the knowledge? Don't God He knew the future, right? 
of course don't god he knew the future yeah they are asking him when is going to be what jesus said only my father right only my yes. father so here the knowledge is about that nobody is going to hear the news about the judgment day except from the father and how you know that by when he sent his son with the glory of his, of his, his angels so imagine, imagine that Jesus had nothing to do with the judgment day, but he is the one who will practice the judgment day. And he is the one who will come with the glory of his angels in the cloud. And he is the one who is going to be the judge over the flesh. And he is the one who told you step by step when it's going to be. And then we say that he do not know. Obviously here about I do not know, but the father, what Jesus he is saying, that the only one is in charge of the announcement of the day is the Father. This is not my job. So Jesus said, my Father work and I work too. So I have my work to do. He have his work to do. I do work, he glorify me, and I glorify him by my yes. work too. So, uh, so, uh, so just to finish the, the comment, so yeah. Jesus, obviously, he is saying to us that this is why we are people who believe the Trinity, the Holy Spirit, the Son, and the Father. Each have a work to do. I do my part. I do my work. The work of the Son present what? Present, present the Father in the same time. That's why Jesus said, my Father sent me. And why he used the word Father, speaking of the authority. Where Jesus got, where Jesus he got the authority from? From the father why because he's a son it's the same as your son now you know if you pass away you know long after you know and uh, your son he will say this is my house okay this is the house of who yes. because it's the house of my father okay, where he got the authority because he is your son correct of course all yes. right but who is the one who announced you to be his son it's you yes. announced the, you know so so you are the father who announced the son to be your son and then the son, by the announcement of the father, he got the authority. And this is the same for Jesus. Jesus announced to be the son of the father by the father himself. When Jesus, he got baptized from John the Baptist, the spirit appeared in the sky and said, this is my only begotten son. So the father announced that this is my only begotten son. And by this announcement, the authority of Jesus appeared to us. Otherwise, Jesus is a man like everybody. How I know? Maybe I can claim that I am the son of God too, and you can claim to be the son of God. But Jesus, he got the announcement from the Father, and Jesus, he was able to do what nobody can do, to prove what was announced about him. This is why he said, my, I, you know, my witness, uh, if I witness to myself, that is not really a witnessing, because witnessing to yourself is not a big deal. Anyone can witness to himself. But my work, mm. my work witness for me, Yes. Uh, to be honest, I, uh, I, uh, I'm not very satisfied with uh, this. Like when he says, "I don't know," um, I, I don't want to waste your time. Uh, no, no, no. It's okay. You don't, you don't have to so, accept. It's up to you. But did he say? Yeah. But he, did he say uh, only I, my? Let, but let did he say my friend? I, I, only my father? Would... Did he say my father? Yes, okay. he said, but uh, he said, I don't know. So I, I don't want to waste your time. Let me just, let me think about it for a, a short time. No like, problem, no problem. Look it out. No problem. Like, but do you need some to understand, research you need to understand, I, you need I, to can, understand, I can call you. Yeah, you need to understand. Day, you, you need to understand something. That, you know, uh, the word father present authority. And this yes. is authority presented in all over in the Middle East. So when Jesus speak about the father, he is speaking about the authority. And the authority, he called him the Father for a reason. So when yes. we speak about the Trinity, obviously the Messiah, he says to the Father, let your will be done. Let your yes. will be done. The will of who? The will of the Father. So everything yes, I I'm, I'm I don't have a problem with saying no no, no uh, just, father, just, just, to, I have just to connect just to connect for problem you. with uh, saying no, 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 no. Uh, that he doesn't know so I really don't want to waste your time Christian Prince right. because I honestly respect you very much so uh, give me some time to uh, think about it so look up no problem my uh, friend thank you more and, I'm uh, happy then for I you I'm happy for you Amar that's you left Islam 
and we will pray for you as a Christians yes. to be saved and to be, be to become a believer. It's up to you anyway. Still, we love you. You become a Christian or not. We pray to the Lord to guide yes. you and show you the truth. Very thankful for you. Okay. Have All right. a nice day. Take Joseph care. Bye-bye. You know, like uh, uh, when a person, he see uh, a comment of Jesus saying that only my father, but he just told you only my father. Mari ikut Yesus. Mari ke jalan yang benar. Tuhan berkati.